Happy Sunday, guys. Happy St. Patrick's Day to those of you who are celebrating. We are heading into St. Breeze. So I'm going to show you a lot. Okay, there you go. <laughs> Got a little bit of that in the shot. Come on, bring it. Hold it up. So we're heading into Sainsbury's. We're gonna do our little shop. It is packed. Literally got about 40 minutes to get the shop done. I've got an anti back wipes here. <laughs> if you know, you know. We've got an anti back wipes. We're gonna run in, grab a few bits, and get out, really. That's what we're going to be doing so let's get in the wipe wipe the trolley you could hold the camera up now and as usual i've got my i've got my mns bag because we stand mns we stand we stand all right and KK's on live. Wait, but guys, you ready? I don't, this is very sticky. I don't like, ugh. Anyway, let's go. Thank you. Come on, buddy. Woohoo! We are going to head straight to the fruit and veg. All right. Let's see. What we're gonna get? Do you want some strobs? These are the prices. Yeah. Yes, please, yes, please, yes. Okay, he wants some strobs. Let me make sure I'm not mauling them and throwing them. Okay. All right, these look nice. All right, put that in the basket, sir. Thank you. Right, what's these blueberries? These are so big and nice, look. Those are big and nice, aren't they? Yeah, those are big. <laughs> what else are we gonna get? Um, do you see anything else you want? Any fruit? That bag is open, you're not gonna get that one. I don't think they've got any of the mixed ones. These are all empty boxes. Um, what about some peaches? Do you want to have some peaches? All right. Sorry. Okay. Well, not peaches, nectarines. Nectarines. Oh. <laughs> no, I don't want those. Yeah, don't, no, we don't want those. How much are the um, pineapples? All right, we've got the jazz apples. These are 20p cheaper than M&S. You've never had those. I'm not gonna buy you those and you not eat them. Okay? You've never had it. You want to try these? Opal apples. Mm. 
Let's get the one from the bottom. He said they're not just apples, they're limited edition opal apples. I've never had these, but he says he wants those, so we're going to get those. All right. What about some... Um, easy peelers? Easy peelers? Bees. Look at that. Yeah, That's that. rot. Oh, really? Right, let's go to the meat section. Oh, I love going in the home section. I don't know why. I get distracted. I know that this is a grocery haul, but I just I have to just pass through here. I just have to. It just feeds my oh my god I like these mirrors <gasps> these are so nice how much are they 45 oh, those are nice look at that Wait. that's so nice and I love this anyway let's let's stay focused come on I feel like this haul is a bit boring because I'm not I'm not really getting what I want. Okay. Let's see. They've got beef sausages. They've not got chicken sausages. Mm. Because they're tiny mini sausages, Kaylan. Okay, these are Fishmonger. Mm. Ah. I feel stressed out. I feel stressed. I literally, I need to get out of here. I literally need to get out. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like I'm getting hot. I'm getting, let me see. Right. Let's look at the chicken. Um, right, look, we've not made a turkey joint in ages. Mm. I feel like I don't even want to eat meat. And I don't have a problem with Sainsbury's at all. I love me a good Saints Bob's, but I don't know, I just can't. There's just too much stuff. And then I just feel like well, 4.30. Well, you're not wrong. Hey guys, this is what we got from Sainsbury's. I had to stop filming while I was in the store because I started getting lightheaded again and just feeling overwhelmed. So I was just like, let me just grab what I could grab and get out. I've not got any meat here. That's okay. We do have some haddock and we do have some chicken. So that's fine. But I did get the bits that I got. So I'm going to show you guys what we got. So basically I've done my shopping in three different categories. So that's category one. This is category two here and that is category three so let's start with category three we got a fairy washing up liquid i don't know who had it cheaper because i wasn't able to check the prices so i just grabbed it and i was like at the store i got two methods these were sort of an offer i try not to use um anything with anti back i hope these don't have anti back in it um because of my hands i've had problem with my hands so I tried to cut out a lot of the anti back hand washes. So this is the sweet coconut. Never used this before. And this is the hibiscus berry. I've used the brand method, but I've never used their hand washes. And I just got the fairy. I usually get Ecova, but they were all around the same price. So I just got the fairy. Okay, so that's one. That's household stuff. So for the general groceries, we got some French fries, okay, because Kaylan loves him some French fries. Yes, I do know you can make these yourself and save money, but ain't nobody got time for that. Okay, these are my favorite veg from Sainsbury's. So we got the vegetable medley. 
It's perfect for omelettes. It's perfect for stir fried rice. It's perfect for every and anything that you need little veg to put in. This is a game changer. I did feel a bit fancy and I got a little bit of this. I don't know how you say this, mate. I don't know how to pronounce it. I'm not going to try. And this is basically a red velvet cake. This ran us about three pounds something. I thought, mm, child, but you know what? You live once, you die once. So here we are. All right. Now we got the garlic pepper. This is a holy grail in our house. We're literally almost out. Let me show you a lot. <laughs> we're holding on. We're clinging on by a little hope and a prayer. So I had to top up. So we got that. Get it, get it, okay? It's really good. All right. We got some easy peelers here. Okay, Sainsbury's easy peelers. I got two pack of gums because I chew when I'm stressed and it's not the nicest sound, but we move. Got an onion. I think this was like 12p. I do buy my onions loose half the time because they will just sit and rot. I got some eggs. So <laughs> I'm going to be petty here. I'm going to be petty. Got some £2.65 eggs here. Perfect. Featherless eggs. <laughs> i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm just being a wind up now featherless even though they come out of the the hen's ass but it's all right <laughs> i would say i'm sorry but i just have a sense of humor i'm sorry if you don't anyway we got eggs for two pound 65 and not the mns three pound 80 eggs okay because i'm expected to drive 13 miles from mns to go somewhere to get to get eggs that's cheaper but okay let's move along i did get their six pack of sweet chili sticks these are quite decent i feel like they would be nice with a really good hummus you know just as a dip i got some sprite because baby sometimes the fizz just keeps me going got these wafers all right I'm not going to lie, confession, I've ate one of these in literally one sitting, a whole pack. That's really, really bad, but anyway. And then we got some toasties, all right? So that's the general household stuff. Now, my son, he does get his own money. So for the person, and I know you're watching, even though you say you're not. So I just want to give you a little bit of an insight. My son does get his own money every month. Maybe you should watch some of my budgeting videos and you'll see. But anyway, let's move along. <laughs> He wanted the baked Walker's crisp. He wanted Skittles, cookies, his Solero. He wanted some strobs, strawberries. We get the sliced white rolls for pack lunch. He wanted some tropical flavor, extra refreshers. Mm. He did want the limited edition opal apples. He said he wanted to try something different. And this is what my eight-year-old chose. Did you not? Did you not? Yeah. Okay, there you go. He wasn't paying attention to me. So this is everything we got. Okay, the household stuff came up to 1903. We saved 40p. Brilliant. Kayland stuff came up to £12.17. We saved 140 on his stuff. Okay. The household stuff came up to nine pounds. So we saved one pound. There you go. All right, so that's it guys. Thanks so much for watching. And for the people in the back, don't be a miserable fucker. Bye. <laughs>